Now this JBL Racing Cheetah 4x4 110 scale 4 drive brushless off-road truggy was sent to me by Gearbest. I'm going to do a review of this and show you everything I like and maybe don't like about this truck. But from first impressions and other videos that I've seen, this is one fantastic uh, brushless off-road truggy. One thing that sets this truck apart is the price. It's fantastic value for money. For what you get in this kit, other manufacturers would charge maybe twice to three times more. Now that's something to consider. If you're looking to get into the hobby, this is something that you should uh, maybe check out. Now the link for this particular bad boy is in the description box below. Please check it out and if you think about buying it, use that link. It's uh, You'll be surprised on uh, what you get for your money. A metal chassis, powerful brushless uh, motor there, waterproof brushless, 80 amp speed controller as well. It does come with a 3S 4000 milliamp hour LiPo. Now that is great. Some of these kits that you see they are actually brushless but then they come with a, just a nickel meter high drive battery. 2.4 gigahertz uh, radio system and all the drivetrain is metal geared. Now once you pull all the goodies out of the box this is what you'll be left with. The cheater itself looks very nice I must admit. A basic wall charge here which is for 2S uh, 3S LiPo charger. It does let you know when it's charging, if there's an error and when it is full which is a nice touch that you know I guess any decent ready to run kit nowadays should include. To charge the LiPo you would use your balance lead on your battery. Obviously this is for the 2S and this is for the 3S battery. The 2.4 gigahertz transmitter is quite nice, feels pretty comfortable in hand. This ergonomic design here is pretty comfy. Four AA batteries, which is great. Steering feel is nice and it's got like a rubber textured, uh, rubber here obviously, but it feels good in the hand. Steering and throttle reverse. Got also your throttle trim here. Throttle and steering dual rates. Nothing too crash hot, but it does the job. Definitely feels good in the hand and uh, I think it'll be more than enough for this car. The manual is pretty comprehensive and easy to follow, all in English and it's got general stuff about the car, what you should be aware of and also a nice exploded diagrams of all the parts of stuff if you ever get lost and need to repair something. Pretty good uh, overview of the electronics and how to set and uh, change some stuff like that. Throttle range calibration. Shock assembly, it's got uh, progressive dual uh, springs as well which is a nice touch and especially for this price point it's nice to see. Front suspension arms assembly, all that kind of good stuff and also if you ever need to find uh, spare parts you know what the parts numbers are here so you can always go online and purchase some more. Now what we all want to see the JLB Racing Cheetah, 1 tenth scale brushless truggy. Now from first impressions it does look very nice and uh, yeah for the price it looks more than what it's actually worth to be honest. These tyres they kind of they look they might look very shiny and plasticky on the video but in real life they are very nice quite plush and they feel extremely grippy they seem like they'll grip very well on tarmac that's for sure. Now upon lifting the hood and the Lex sand feels very similar to any normal Traxxas kit or anything like that or HBI body so it does feel quite nice and it seems like it'll put up with the abuse that inevitably you will be putting on this puppy. It seems very well built. It has all Allen keyed uh, screws top, top and bottom. Very nice with a, these plastic side components here on the chassis. Very beefy steel reinforced upper deck plate here to stop it from becoming like a banana in massive hits. This kit does come with uh, LEDs in the front bumper which I think is a nice touch. They definitely look good and are plenty bright. The battery is held in place via these velcro straps and like I mentioned it does come with a hard case 3S 4000 milliamp hour 30C battery. 
this should give you run times of roughly 20 to 30 minutes which is fantastic and really nice to see that this is uh, standard in the kit also included is a factory installed wheelie bar which is very nicely done and it also is uh, feels like it's ball bearing to you so it does roll very nice front bumper has a bit of give feels like just the right amount of give in for a head-on impact like that has like that kind of cushion part there which would obviously take up a bit of the uh, impact so here is a progressive dual spring suspension system you've got one spring here and it's divided by a little plastic piece here with another spring up top and also to note while I'm on here these are actually threaded alumin aluminium bodied uh, springs and shock bodies and everything it's very nicely done and it also has these shock boots here to keep dust and everything away from the uh, shaft very nice nice touch these are huge 17 millimeter wheel nuts here so you could use uh, like bad hands or something on here which would fit without a problem so the servo is nestled down here 15 kilo rated there so it's not too bad and it's pretty good speed at 0 0.15 second at 60 degrees so for a stock kit uh, not too bad that's easy upgrade as well if you want to change it up later it does come with a servo saver as well to uh, help mitigate any big damages you might get from uh, hard landing or crash so it's good to see that that's included as well the uh, motor here does look quite nice uh, beautiful blue color and all the motor mounts and stuff like that seem to be well machined and the tolerances are quite tight as it states here it's a 3670 2500kv brushless waterproof motor now a nice motor like that would be useless without a decent uh, ESC and what we have here is a waterproof brushless continuous current of 80 amps so this should be more than enough to uh, get this puppy moving that's for sure so that's all for this video guys I know you don't really care anymore about what you see here and what's in the box you want to see what it is capable of and me giving a good hit around probably some grass dirt BMX track just general driving and see how this puppy holds up if you want more information about this bad boy please use the link down below it goes directly to the uh, GearBest site you can purchase it from there it is on sale at the moment plus there are a lot of other videos and stuff like there if you want to check them out as well so if you like the video give it a thumbs up please if you haven't subscribed please do so because the running video for this is coming very soon so please check that out Steve here again from RC Tanks and Trucks 24 7 cheers guys and have a good day